As summer break draws to a close, Pike County authorities are focusing their efforts on ensuring the safety of students as they return to school. We just, as officers in this department, uh, we make sure that we're at the school zones in the morning and the evenings, and uh, basically we do traffic control, uh, make sure the buses get in and out safely, uh, parents get in and, out, in and out safely. Of course, uh, on the bypass where the city schools are at, uh, traffic backs up, so we try to make sure that it moves as smoothly as can, as can be expected at this time of year. Local law enforcement will be increasing their presence around school zones and bus stops to monitor and enforce traffic rules. Please watch out for the school buses. They are painted bright yellow for a reason, uh, so that way they're, you can see them from way far away. Uh, when the stop sign's out, that means stop. Uh, we will be monitoring that, as always, like we have in past years, and you will get road a ticket if you pass a school bus with stop sign out. And a lot of the city school buses has cameras on them. So it's going to, it's going to show us the license plate of the person that does that. And they're going to get a ticket. It, 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 it's, not going to, it's not going to be a warning from the city of Pike Police Department. It's going to be a ticket when you pass a school bus with a stop sign out. When my baby was born, it was magical. And as she grew, having a hospital close to home with advanced health care and specialized physicians being there along the journey was important. And along that journey, many special doctors touched our lives. And then one day, my baby became a woman and a mother herself. Pikeville Medical Center, caring for every moment in life. Authorities also encourage parents to educate their children about safe pedestrian practices, including looking both ways before crossing the street, using designated crosswalks, and avoiding distractions such as electronic devices while walking near traffic. We want all the kids to be safe. We want the parents to be safe, uh, the bus drivers, the faculty, staff. And the only way we can do that is to make sure everybody obeys the rules of the road, keep their eyes on the road, uh, put the phone down in school lines. Uh, I've seen people roll up and almost hit kids by texting and driving. Just, just kind of be aware of your surroundings. Treat everybody the way you want your kids treated or your wife or your husband or whatever that's uh, at the school working. Keep that in consideration. So we try as a department to be as uh, professional as we can be, and we're going to do that. But when you break the laws, especially at a school or in a school zone, um, you're going to, the law is specific, and you shall get a citation. Reporting for Mountain Top News, I'm Ethan Miller.